Hello my lovely Aries. This is a reading to see who or what is actually coming towards you guys in the upcoming week. Okay. Let's go ahead and check this out. See what's going on for my Aries. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter guys. Hopefully something good. Let's see. You have a magician. Somebody trying to manifest something here. This is Virgo, Gemini energy. Um, maybe Aquarius also here. There's somebody that feels like um, you guys were made for each other. There's something between you that just cannot be explained. Four Cups, Cancer energy. I feel like somebody's trying to get your attention. And this person may feel like you guys are not really open to, like, you know, having an emotional exchange. They feel like you're very stable and that you guys really could give a shit, actually. <coughs> I feel that they're trying to get your attention, though, by doing subtle things. Maybe trying to throw you hints or some shit. I don't know. Then we have the King of Cups energy. Hmm. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces is here. This person may feel like you guys are actually involved with someone else. But what I'm getting is that there's two people here right now. There's two people here right now. There's somebody that's trying to get your attention, that's wanting to manifest something with you, but they feel like you you may not be interested, that you may be comfortable um, where you're at right now. Then you have a King of Cups energy, two um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that has his back turned or her back turned, as if there was something that was going on between the two of you and this person is no longer in your life or you have pushed them away they feel something um, of that nature here then we have the nine of swords this person's in their feelings this king of cups oh they are so in their feelings um, but I, I'm getting that this person is playing a blame game with you guys and not really taking responsibility for what they have done. I feel like this person has been playing mind games. Maybe um, some emotional manipulation has been going on with you guys and you guys just are not having it anymore. But then you have this magician over here. For some of you this magician and this king of cups is the same person yeah I'm feeling like this king of cups is not in the best of energy though and may have been trying to trick you manipulate you here okay let's see what else okay and then we have the six of cups there there's somebody here there is a second person here that feels like you're their soulmate you guys may have children together or either this person just looks at you like you are family regardless if you guys have children together or not Scorpio energy there's something more than just love here again I felt that this person um, looks at you like you are the one there's something about you that they just cannot put their finger on then we have the Knight of Wands energy this King of Cups very flaky I think you knew it was something about them or you know it's something about them there's something about them this player um, energy of being in and out flaky, you know, wanting to hit it and leave or what have you, and you guys are not having it. You're not having it. Could definitely be a Sagittarius, um, Scorpio, Cusper, 
okay does not have to be but this this is just the energy that I'm seeing here okay could also be a cancer Leo cusper let's see what else do we have but you know what the thing is though this king of cups also feels like there's something about you guys you guys you you have this aura you you're exuding something um spectacular this week and you're being noticed by several different people i feel now we have the queen of swords here hmm yeah this person you're not feeling them this king of cups energy you're not feeling them um you you don't want to hear, hear anything they have to say i feel like you guys are just kind of done and over this situation with this um king of cups here because mm -mm. you're, you're not about the bullshit you're not with it <clears throat> And then we have the Eight of Pentacles there. Oh, yeah. Virgo energy. You have a Virgo. I feel Leo, Virgo, Cancer, Sagittarius, Gemini for you guys. Um, but this magician oh they want something concrete with you guys here they want something concrete with you guys here this king of cups i feel like if they could change things with you if they could do things differently i feel like they would because i think that they are getting they didn't take you seriously they didn't take you seriously initially okay but you have laid down the law, I feel. And now this person's like, damn it, Aries. Whew, what did I do? If I could turn back the hands of time. Because I probably screwed up. Look at this. Ace of Wands. Probably you did, King of Cups. Because now you've got... Hmm. This Ace of Wands here. This person is very attracted to you. But the thing is, they're coming across like they only want to hit it. Like they're not serious. And I think that is... That's how they presented themselves. And you're just not having it. But now they're thinking that they really, really messed up. And there's nothing they can do to fix it. Because I feel like not only do they are they attracted to you, yeah, they want to have sex with you, but they also they see something significant with you guys and want to work on it, build with you. Hmm. I feel like you're not hearing it anymore though. Mm -mm, you're not with it. You got somebody coming in that you probably don't even suspect. Okay, Virgo, Gemini. Aquarius, Scorpio, and I feel Aries or Leo here too. Page of Pentacles. This person's coming with something. They're coming with a stable offer. Something that you can hang your hat on. This earth energy. They're coming. It's not going to be anything like that's going to wow you, um, but I think they will definitely make their presence known here. Okay, so that is what I have for you guys for this week, and I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.